Hi, good day everybody. Uh, today to try hack me release very interesting room. Uh, usually Friday is uh, the only release CTF at night, but today is there is the uh, for one for Outlook and TLM leak. This is I like it especially because it's CCV. I heard a lot about it in the news last couple of weeks. Uh, and this time try hack me release this room that give you really an idea how this attack work how it get exploited and how you detect it and how protect yourself for it it give you a really feel that you are a hacker if you do this okay the idea of course here is how to abuse the appointment alert in uh, in outlook now you can click here to make an, uh, an appointment in Outlook. Of course, you can hit new appointment. Of course, this warning because now we're using the trial trial version for the Outlook. So the warning is fine. If you click in your appointment, as always, you can change, for example, point to zero minute the sound file, and that's what uh, you can see is a default. Okay, it's fine. The idea here for this attack is to abuse the sound file. The idea is to how we can call the sound file from our attack box and then abusing the UNC paths in Outlook. The certain parameter we need to change for that. I'm not uh, exactly too familiar with these things, but we can follow the room. So that's the idea. Send an email with embedded appointment this the attacker captured the hash from the PC. We'll see this live. That's what's a good cool about it. You summon the SB protocol, we're using SMB protocol via alternative. So so let's start here. First of all in our attack book because now we're trying to capture the the authentication that come to us we'll use now we'll use responder is is a simple emulator of SMB server that's what it is it's not something so we can use responder minus ins5 for our interface so let it run there then we come here our first thing we can we could manually create and apparently did the path uh, sign let's do that so if we try to edit as we showed before the sound file, let's see if we can try to edit it to our IP. Okay, I didn't get my IP. It should be 10.10. .10. Let's see what is it. Let's see what is it. The IP is 156.113. So we can do non-existence, so it's not non-existent. Uh, Sound.wave But if we do this, now Outlook will detect that like it's a mistake or something and you don't save it. If we can go back, we go back to default. So how to solve this problem? Now there is a, what they call it Outlook Spy. Outlook Spy is the one we can detect. If we go to Outlook Spy and current item, it show you all the item have been used. This is the variable that we looking for. It's easy for us to look which variable we use by the appointment. We are more interested in this variable, the play sound, the, 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 the one that related to sound. Now we can go to script like we show here in, uh, and we need to change them to true. So we need to, to, to do that. Appointment item not a reminder. So we have three of them to change. Override default equal true. Make sure the spelling is correct. Reminder override true, then appointment item. Now there's something point mint. So, what the hell am I doing? The appointment with one um, appointment. Item dot 
remind the play sound you go true then appointment item dot uh, remind the sound file and that's where the trick will come in I don't me I forgot again my IP uh, 10 dot 10 dot what the hell 128 or something I don't know I forgot about it so let's uh, let's get it quickly 156113 156113 156113 okay the, the, the file no existent sound.wave no we need to right click run make sure it's there and then if you go to property again we make sure that remind the set remind this remind this uh, true then the sound file change that's correct remind the play sound play song why it's you false <coughs> uh, because item reminder play sound item dot reminder play sound because this is was wrong see it's good it's better to check then this one also a tiny bit wrong, eh? something is uh, not right. Okay, we can run. Why is uh, Appointment item dot reminder override default reminder play sound true. I think I did something really wrong. This let me cancel this. No, let me not save. Let me make a new appointment. Let me make it zero item. Uh, display the Qualcomm script no I don't tell me need to type again oh, my goodness Ash. point mint item dot <coughs> reminder override default you go true appointment remind the play sound you go true and then appointment remind the sound file equal 10 dot 10 dot uh, 1.13 13 uh, non existent tent and then sound that wave okay let me sh make sure everything is fine run script I should run I go to property 
let's check what we have here remind remind the play play sound sound file is this play sound true override default it's true so we are cool now so so we did uh, so we make sure that uh, uh, let's make it uh, closer to this now today is 342 342 342 this three uh, 42 make it 43 so we can just I'm, I'm, I'm looking at this the time so we can make it near so let's see what happened oh it's here 42 let's see the time 342 that's 43 let's go to our attack box nothing yet why is nothing yet Twenty four Friday, three forty PM. It should re reflect here. Okay. So yes, save it. Three forty. Okay, it's come now. Now we should have the. We can shove it. Now we're looking for this and TLM. Oh, okay, we got it. You can see. Now we got it does feel good when you when I saw this to be honest with you it's like you feel something live. Now we got this. So we got our NTLM. So it work. Now the idea now how to weaponize the venerable GT. Now create a malicious meeting appointment and send it to a person or someone. Send the invite to the victim and then wait for a trigger connection and capture the net NTLM version to hash of course the 3 and 4 we already have it because we're using responder so the f what left is number 1 and was then 2 how to create a malicious code and send to uh, email to uh, to the person now now what uh, try hack me is using proof of concept of this guy the, the, that's the proof of concept Odav Mu. So the script, I think it's in a, uh, it's on PowerShell. Uh, so it's in the desktop, CD desktop. Now you can see import model CV PS1. That's imported. That's the script. The script is in the. Uh, uh, where is it? Um, I think is this is the shift and then let's not open it with the uh, open with text editor notepad see this is our script that create the whole things for us let's do that so now it after importing then we can send calendar the leak recipient let's say test at tryhackme dot local remote file path again how I forget again my famous IP it should be somewhere here 158.113 let's guess it's true 158.113 one five one five six one thirteen one five six one thirteen ten dot ten dot one five six dot one thirteen and then bar dot wave and then meeting subject try hack me meeting 
meeting then meeting body this is just a regular meeting invitation emoji so let's do that now outlook will complain because of course we're doing it locally so there'll be a lot of uh, security we need to allow allow that's why we need to change just allow for the next 10 minutes allow you can skip this run is running allow let's close this one outlook it's allowed now we can go to our attack box this is the cool part again you see we, we got the second one also the first one and this is the second one it's a really cool uh, it's very dangerous because there's no click or nothing you just send an invitation or something and then of course it become the, the job of cracking the hash detection and mitigation of course the community they release of course sigma rules for it and then there is a Yara rules too for it uh, to detect this and Microsoft also released something if I'm not mistaken uh, Yara rule we can test it here because in desktop there is a Yara CVE dot yar dot txt and then the appointment message is, a, is another for appointment to test here and you can see a suspicious uh, it was get powershell script microsoft release powershell script it seems there is this one this one that you can use to detect and conclusion this is a uh, just a room there is no, I think no points on it or something but it's very good from tryhack me to start uh, getting rooms for latest CVs thank you very much hope you learned something from this as I me too this is all of it new for me thank you very much have a good day